Hello, hello again, my T Intero family. This is a general read, so it may or may not resonate with you. Take what does, leave what doesn't. Energy is fluid, so feel free to flip this switch and put yourself where you fit up in it. And last but not least, any pronouns that I use, he, she, her, him, speaking of masculine or feminine energy, unless otherwise stated, guys, okay? We're going to jump in and see what the Divine Master has to say to the Karmic and also what he wants to say to the Divine Femme here. What's going on in the situation? What the situation may be? What information we can get, okay? We're going to start off with the Divine Masculine talking to the Karmic or we're going to see if he's actually going to talk to her or we can just see what's going on with their situation. What information we can get. What information can we get for the Divine Masculine and the Karmic? What's going on in the Divine Masculine and the Karmic situation here, Spirit? In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. And we do need it to jump. What's going on with the Divine Masculine and the Karmic right now? Okay, so somebody's in the Nine of Swords energy. So, okay, so the Divine Masculine is in the Nine of Swords energy here. He could be... Um, oh, no, 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 no. I heard the Karmic is in the Nine of Swords energy about the Divine Masculine here, okay? Um, they said switch it around. Divine Masculine is listening to his intuition and ready to move forward here. And the karmic is all in her into I mean is all in her feelings. Can't eat, can't sleep here in this nine of swords energy about this emperor here. Tell me more, which is the divine masculine. Tell me more. Yes, okay, so we have this King of Wands energy here, uh Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. This is somebody who is very attractive, standing in their power here. They're getting their power back. I feel like this is divine masculine. He's getting his power back. He is healing. There's four of swords here. And yeah, Six of Swords, he's walking away from the emotional conflict and moving towards something peaceful here. And this is why the karmic is all in her head here about this Divine Master because he's found his power. He's healed himself and he's moving on. He's listening to his intuition. Tell me more about... Yep. <laughs> Can't make it up. He has put an end to this karmic deceptive in... Um, Deceptive energy here, okay? This this karma could have been lying, cheating, sneaky, okay? And and he ended this. He's transformed himself. Told you he ended her. He's ended this bitch. He's dead. He's transformed. He's headed towards the light here, okay? Which is his divine feeling. He's headed towards the light. The queen of pentacles, which is divine feeling. The high priestess, divine femme, okay? The queen of pentacles and this high priestess energy, I feel like, is the, the divine femme here, okay? This is someone who's very intuitive, someone who's very mysterious here, someone who's about their money, someone who is practical, mother figure, um, down to earth. As you see the butterflies here, they're headed towards their transformation. And they're transforming with this high priestess here. Does divine master want to say anything to the karmic? He says, I'm in love. I'm in love. What else does he want to say to the permit? Yeah. I, I'm, I'm, I'm ending this and I'm moving forward. I'm dropping this tower because I'm in love. I'm going towards the woman that I'm in love with. What else does the Divine Master want to say to the permit? He says, yeah, this is over. Our relationship is over. I, <laughs> whatever we had has come to an end. You want to say anything else to the permit? He said, yeah, judgment has been has been made and has been called. I, I'm I'm passing judgment here. I no longer want to be in this with you. I'm I'm headed towards my love. Who I love. Anything else that the, the divine master wants to say to the karmic? Queen of Swords. He said, Look, you a bitch. I'm I'm, I'm healing from this. I'm healing from all your toxicity because it landed up here on the healing. Came in out in reverse. I'm healing from your toxic energy. I'm healing from this toxicity. I'm, I'm done. I no longer want to deal with it. Yeah. I'm no longer checking for you. No longer looking for you. No longer watching you. I'm, I'm done. Three of Wands, I'm moving towards my future. And he's speaking his truth. Divine Masculine is speaking his truth. He has spoken his truth. Whatever it was between you guys is over. He's no longer dealing with this karmic. He's upright, King of Swords, the karmic. She still um, says you're in bitch mode. You're a bitch. This is why I don't want to deal with you anymore. 
I'm done. I'm not checking for you. I'm not looking for you. I'm moving towards my future here. And my future is with this Queen of Cups here, the Queen of Wands, the High Priestess. All three of those energies is, let me put it over here. This is all one person. This is their energy. They're loving. They're practical. They're down to earth. They're about their money. They're mysterious. They listen to their intuition. Um, I want to say like they're all knowing here, okay? They could have psychic abilities here. But this is where they're headed to. Divine Master is headed to this person right here. Okay, and, and he's coming in as the King of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Um, yeah, we have Earth here. He's, he's not coming, not trying to reconcile with the karmic. There's no reconciliation here. He is done. No reconciliation. Yet. Yeah, there's nothing to even see. <laughs> Everything is known, unknown in reverse. Everything is known. Okay, the truth has been said, it's been spoken. There's no secrets here. There's nothing left hidden. He has came and he has made love. He is no longer making an offer to this Carmen. She knows exactly what is going on. He has spoken his truth and he has told the Carmen exactly what it is. I'm going to my divine fam and there's nothing you can say to stop me from having this future with him. Or with him. Okay. So let's see what the divine masculine would like to say. To the divine feminine, what's going on in the divine masculine and divine femme situation? What's going on in the divine masculine and divine femme situation in their relationship? What's going on between divine masculine and divine femme? What's going on in your situation? What's going on between divine masculine and divine femme at this time? And anything that the divine master may want to say. Uh oh, that was the worst shuffle. You wouldn't even think I play spades around here, y'all. All my life. 40, 40, 40 years. The way I just shuffled them cards. Okay. One last shuffle, guys. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. What is Divine Masculine and Divine Femme got going on right now, Spirit? What's going on with Divine Masculine and Divine Femme? Huh. Luck is on your side. Things are changing in your favor. The Wheel of Fortune here, okay? Um, closing out old cycles. Starting something new. Finally, finally getting this chance to move forward here. That's what I'm hearing. Tell me more about Divine Masculine and Divine Femme's relationship. Yeah, moving away from not getting an offer to finally having the chance to have this offer here. Things are changing in your favor. Not being able to act on the offer or not being able to give the offer. Divine Masculine is now coming out of that. Yep. Eight of Swords here. Um, no longer guarded or blocked or unable to come forward because the karmic is gone now. So whatever burdens and barriers that was keeping the Divine Masculine from coming forth in the past, they're no longer there. There's no blockages. What else is coming into this, this relationship here? Yeah, so this past relationship, he released the past relationship. He's coming towards, he's coming towards you, divine fam. He's saying he let it go. Yeah, he's no longer in this king of wands energy either. He's no longer in this in and out energy. He's coming for something long term and stable. He released, he released whatever this was that was keeping him from coming towards you. Whatever he was unable to see, which we know is the karmic. He, he wants you to know that things are changing in his favor. He's closed out this cycle here. He's no longer giving to this karmic energy. He has blocked her. He has cut her off. He is done. He's no longer giving to this relationship. He's not having sex with her. There's nothing passionate there. He's cut off all feelings and emotions towards this karmic is what he's saying here. Hey, tell me more, Spirit. Yeah, he's no longer in this Seven of Swords energy. Nothing sneaky, store, nothing sneaky um, or deceptive here going on, okay? He has released this. He has released this person. He's released this energy. Okay. Okay, so can you tell me more? 
about what's going on with Divine Masculine and Divine Femme. So we know he's coming in. He's letting Divine Femme know that he is no longer guarded. He's no longer blocked. He's no longer blinded by this, this karmic here, okay? He has completely walked away and shut off all ties, all intimacy, all connections with this Divine Femme. There's no nothing sneaky, nothing deceptive, nothing going on here between him and this karmic. He says he's coming towards you, Divine Femme. He's on his way. He's coming in quickly. He's headed towards your way. Things are finna change. He, he feels like luck is on his side here. Yeah, he feels like the King of Pentacles here, okay? He feels like Big Day, like he got his money together, like he's practical, he's stable, he's thought things out, okay? He's made a plan, and he's coming in with this plan. He's coming in to initiate this plan. Tell me more, Spirit, about Divine Master. Yep. He said, I see a, a future here with you, Divine Femme, and I'm coming to I'm coming to have this future with you. I'm coming to offer you this future. I'm no longer blocked here. There's nothing holding me back. I have released. What else, Spirit? Yep. He said he put an end into it. He put an end into it, and he has transformed the situation. This is what was holding him back in the past. He wasn't able to come forward because he hadn't ended this past shit. But he's ended it now. He is completely, he is completely done with it because this came out crossing it. So, yeah. This is what was holding him back from coming forth in the past because he had to go through the transformation. He had to actually completely cut this relationship out 100%. He had to, to let go of it, and he did. He has transformed. Ooh, yep. And he's coming in quickly with some type of conversa conversation um, or coming to you because he wants to talk about whatever lies and deception there may have been, whatever secrets, whatever sneakiness. Right, falls right up under the seven of swords. Whatever was not seen or said in the past. He's coming to bring you truth and clarity about everything. He's coming to lay it all on the line. Whatever needs to be said, whatever needs to be done, he's on his way. He's coming because he wants to transform this situation with his divine sin. Right. He's coming in quickly as the king of swords to give you some truth and clarity. He's coming to talk about Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. It doesn't have to be, but they're in that energy. Yep, they have a lot of regrets. He has a lot of regrets about the cups that were not offered or things from the past. Okay, he wants to fix the past. He wants to fix the past and the fact that there was no reconciliation in the past, that there was lies and deception in the past. Okay, he wants to fix whatever this was. Look, four of cups in reverse. He's hoping that you accept this offer, that you don't reject it. And he's trying to manifest this new beginning here with you. What do you want to say, Divine Masculine, directly to her? He wants you to let your guards down. He wants to come to you and talk to you about letting your guards down. About forgiving him from the past. Yep, he knows he hurt you. Um, knows it's been a while. He has a lot of regrets. He wants to move forward from it. He's hoping that you're capable and able of moving forward from it. Yep, can't make it up. He's praying to God that he has victory and a brand new star with you. Can't make it up, guys. The sun, the best card in the deck. Six of Wands, victory and success. The world, a whole new beginning. Closing our old cycle, starting something new. And this is the way it came out. The sun, the six of wands, and the world. They're praying for victory and success here. They want a whole new beginning here with you. I seen judgment in reverse. They're hoping that you don't pass judgment on them. That you allow them another chance. Look, queen of swords. Upright. They say we're a divine couple. I want to transform this as soulmate. They're coming for you. They're coming for you. And they're praying that everything works out. They're having hope and faith. Yep. The six of, six of swords here. They're moving away from the emotional conflict, the, the karmic. They have actually did the work. They have actually cut this person out for sure, for good. They are done. And they're coming to you. Here they come. They're on the way. They know they didn't put the work in in the past, but they're coming to bring you love now. King of Cups. They're coming to show you. They know in the past they didn't give you the love. <laughs> now they're coming. Look. They said, in the past I wasn't showing you the love. I had a lot of love for you, but I was just sitting back watching. Now I'm coming to take this leap of faith. I'm coming to transform the situation. Okay? So Divine Femme, they're coming. They're no longer sitting back and watching. They have made a decision. They have made a choice. And the decision is you. Okay, guys? So, oh, that one too? Okay. Hmm. Look. It's no longer unknown because it was in reverse. Okay? So they, they have made a choice. It's no longer unknown. They have made a decision. They know exactly who, what, when, where, how. They have made a practical plan. 
what they want to do, who they want to do it with, and how they want to do it. And as you divine feminine, they're on their way. Okay? So I'm going to leave this here until next time. If it resonates with you guys, please leave me a comment down below. If you're interested in booking products or in booking a personal, just go down below in the description box. If you're interested in leaving me a tip or a donation, that is down below as well. For all who have booked, who have bought, or who have left me a tip or donation, thank you guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. It is greatly appreciated. For all who have left comments, who have clicked the little thumbs up, who have subscribed, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, because that means just as much to me, if not more. Okay? So until next time, you guys, you keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace, my babies. Mwah! Bye, guys.